so in this video i'm going to show you how you can create a virtual machine in microsoft azure so let me show you how you can do that so first of all you need to go to your azure panel as you can see then you need to click on virtual machine then you need to create click on create then you as you can see you need to select your subscription for me i select the student subscription so then you need to create a resource group name just type anything so then you need to name the virtual machine just type the name then you need to select the location as you can see there is lot of location server location as you can see for me i i need to select the indian server then i'm going to select the availability zone 2 then you need to select the operating system for me i'm going to select the windows server 2019 as you can see click on here then you can see all the operating system here from here you can select all the operating system then you need to select the pc specification the requirement for you as you can see there is lot of specification virtual machine as you can see all the virtual machine cost different so i am going to select the cheapest one as you can see there is lot of virtual machine each one takes different charges for month as you can see all the machine these are hundred dollar over hundred dollar so I'm going to select the eleven dollar per month virtual machine for the demonstration only so as you can see these are the most expensive one so as you can see these are 200 400 dollar per month so these are the really fast virtual machine i think so you can use that so for me so for me i'm going to use the cheapest one so you can find the cheapest one on the top as you can see 11 dollar per month so for the demonstration i'm going to select that so all the ram and vm cpu as you can see so i'm going to select the 11 dollar one so then you need to type the username then you need to type the username you need to add a specific a special character a special character like at the rate then you need to type the password so i'm going to blur this So after that you just click on review and create you need to click on review and create then it's going to validate the process so it's running the final validation 
and as you can see on the bottom it's going to cost you 0 0.01 cent every hour this virtual machine so according to that you need to have the credit on your subscription so you need to just create click on create then it's going to deploy the virtual machine so as you can see on the top the initializing deployment is in process so submitting so couple of minute later you're going to use the you can use the virtual machine as you can see the deployment is in process so we are going to use the IP address so I'm going to wait for the IP address and we are going to go to the next step so as you can see the my virtual machine has been deployed so i'm going to click on that and as you can see this is loading now you can get the ip address to log in on your remote desktop pc so as you can see the deployment has been successful so just click on go to resource so now you can see all the detail for your virtual machine so let it load the website so now as you can see this is the operating system its status is running as you can see now you need to get the IP address from the bottom as you can see this is the public IP address just copy that just and then you need to download a software called rd client then open the rd client application then add pc then you need to pass the ip address then you need to add the user account which you added before on the panel so you need to just type the username and the password you provide before and the rdp has been connecting so you can see the configuring remote pc so as you can see our virtual machine up and running so this is how you can create a rdp or a virtual machine on the azure panel so that's it that's it the video i will see you in the next tutorial so goodbye